Hey guys, it's Greg Jones for Engine Builder. We are here at the Builders Brawl just outside of St. Louis at Worldwide Technology Raceway. I'm joined by Craig Shefshack of Extreme Innovations and Fabrication. Behind us is his 66 Chevelle with a 564 cubic inch pro-charged Hemi, and it's our Engine of the Week. Engine Builders Engine of the Week is sponsored by Pengrave. Precision Performance Pengrave. Always the original green oil. L-Ring DOS Original. Leading technology, leading service. And NPW and Engine and Performance Warehouse. For all your parts needs. Craig, thanks so much for giving us a couple minutes here today on, uh, on race day at the Builders Brawl. Uh, you know, we saw your run last night at te the Test and Tune, and uh, you got definitely a very quick car here and wanted to know more about your setup. Yeah, it's a 564 uh, Allen Johnson based uh, Pro Charged uh, deal that uh, Fuller Engines had built out of Ohio. It's got a 140 uh, Pro Charger on it, makes plenty of power. Um, we dyno it at FuelTech. It's got a FuelTech uh, EFI system on it with uh, billet atomizer uh, injectors. And uh, yeah, I mean, it made a lot of power. It made like 3,300 horse wheel, wheel uh, horsepower. So um, just uh, dialing her in and try to have a little bit of fun with it and stuff. So, but uh, other than that, uh, it's just uh, got zoomies on it. Uh, now you mentioned that the engine was built uh, at a shop up in Ohio. Do you want to talk about some of the work that they did here and, and maybe some of the components that you got inside of it? Well, it's uh, got a Bryant uh, billet crank. Um, it's got uh, aluminum rods, of course. Uh, and basically, it's an Allen Johnson all aluminum billet deal with, uh, with a Frankenstein uh, billet intake on it. Um, and then we, uh, like I said, built all the fuel tank, uh, all the accessories that go with it. Did it a full complete chassis and stuff. So, but uh, other than that, I pretty much let the engine builder do his thing and just tell him what we're doing with it and stuff. So, um, that's. Um, and, and what type of fuel are you guys running? This is an M1 BP. Um, yeah, so it's uh, definitely likes its uh, likes its fuel. So, it's got dual 700 pound an hour injectors in it. So, but uh, makes about 50, 55 pounds of boost. You know. The, with the F, you know, with the F140, yep. so. Very nice. And how about in terms of the oiling setup? Are you guys running a dry sump or a wet sump? Or? Oh, it is a wet, it's a systems one uh, wet sump. Okay. Um, so uh, basically uh, that's what we feel that uh, was all we need on here. So um, some people like dry sump, some like wet sump, and but it seems to be not a problem with what we're doing here, so. Awesome. Uh, anything else in the engine or just anything else that you guys did in terms of getting it installed and, and working on? Well, we have a shop and then we, so we do everything pretty much in-house. And uh, so we built the chassis, like I said, all the fuel system uh, wiring, uh, all the body and paint. And uh, that's, all, that's all you guys? Yeah, that's all on, a, yep, yep. So that's what we have a shop up in uh, Green Bay, Wisconsin. Okay. Um, and that's what we do, so, and then and Craig, you mentioned uh, it's about 3,300 horsepower to the wheel. Yep. And uh, talk about some of your expectations out there on the track for the weekend. You know, what uh, what are you guys hoping for? Well, I mean, hopefully we we, you know, we can win, but uh, we are kind of in, in the testing stages yet. Uh, the car is only a year old, and uh, with having a business, we just don't get out as test as much as we like to. But uh, we're here, um, no Joe, and uh, it's a pretty cool event that we get to come out and kind of display some of our work. Um, and then, um, so I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, hopefully the thing runs low, run some low four, you know, four O's somewhere in there in the uh, eighth mile. So, you know, hopefully we can uh, just keep going rounds. Yeah, yeah, very good, very good. Well, um, really awesome, awesome Chevelle. You know, we were commenting on the white last night. It looks great out there on the track. Awesome Hemi here, and we appreciate you telling us a little bit about it. All right, well, and, I appreciate uh, it. Thanks wish for you, wish you good luck today. All right, thanks a lot. Guys, make sure you're checking out Extreme Innovations and Fabrications, and make sure you're checking out Engine Builder for more engine content. And we appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time.